Hey guys, welcome back to a new video. So today I'm going to be doing the long-awaited uh, video on my favourite nudes or browns for um, people of um, a brown skin tone, tan skin tone, olive skin tones, any skin tones to, in general, but more specifically kind of like brown tan olive skin tones so i have a bunch here that i've really been enjoying now i do have a, i think i've done two before so i'll try and link those in the info box of other colors i do like and i still use but these are just more recent ones i mean some maybe i think maybe one or two i've already shown before but um yeah some of these are really really nice i am wearing a coat by the way it's from primark um I'm a bit chilly right now but anyways before we go into the video i'm gonna do my post notification shout out and today's one goes to purely april so thank you so much for your comment right i think i'm gonna start off with my most favorite one and it is the avon lipstick in marvelous mocha this was actually gifted to me by my friend nina and she literally knows me like this is one of my favorite lipsticks it's just like a beautiful like peachy nude brown i don't know it's really really pretty it's matte and it smells really really nice i'm just gonna pop this on it's so pretty now sometimes i do feel like i have to wear a lip liner with this um sometimes i don't when i put a little bit but i feel like i need a lip liner I mean that's okay i don't know i really like this one so this is marvelous mocha and literally like this lipstick is so comfy as well like it's just really nice The next one that I really do love, and it's also drugstore, it's the Soph lipstick in Fudge. If you're brown, you need this colour. I mean, look, just look how pretty that is. And the packaging is so cute as well look at that so yeah this is the soap lipstick in fudge it's so nice i really like this one now this one's not really matte it's got a shine to it but again it's super comfortable and it stays really well on the lips So the next one I have is more of a high-end one. It's the Buxom Vava Plump Lights Down. This lights down, yeah. This comes in a tube like this. This recently came out actually. And it's a really like just like a warm, pretty gloss. And it does like kind of plump the lips as well. It's like um almost a colour no like the colour of my coat but lighter. As you can tell I really do like peachy colours. I really do. So yeah, this is lights down. You could also just put a little bit less and use a lip liner and it will definitely make it more wearable but this is the, the colour itself Next, on to the next colour the next one is part of the new NYX suede matte lipstick I recently did a review on this but like these are so nice I can't like say that enough these are so nice the form is amazing so i've been really liking rose the day which looks like this with a focus and i use it with the um cold brew lip liner in the same range i 
Now I did mention that this li uh, lip liner was a bit dry and dragging but it was because it was new I've been using it more and it's like super creamy now so that was my bad Didn't I say I'm so clumsy and I drop everything? Alright let's just pretend that never happened I feel like this colour is definitely a dupe for the um, Huda Beauty Liquid Matte in Bikini, Bikini Babe. This is super light on its own, but once you get like the lip liner. You just tweak it a little bit, I, I kind of like it. And this technique of using a lip liner and um, a lighter colour in the middle really makes like doubles the size of your lips. Like I find that it definitely does that for me. But this is what this combo looks like. It's so beautiful. I will write um, all this stuff downst um, downstairs <laughs> in the info box um, in order so and link everything as well so you guys can find it easily. But yeah, this is this combo. I really, really like it. And it's so comfy, it's like there's nothing on my lips. So the next one is another one of my favourites. I'm going to use MAC Cork Lip Pencil. Again, if you are brown or tan or anything, this is matte cork is like a beautiful brown lip liner. I recommend it to anyone. But anyways, the next one is the Snay Matte Liquid Lip Color by Rimmel. This one's in the shade which one? Mocha. Sorry. Oh, and by the way, guys, I get so many questions on these lashes. These are Coco lashes in a more. Um, they're like one of my favorite favorite lashes. They're so beautiful. They're really out there, but they just make your look just look so glam, you know. So with this one, I wait till it dries, and then I go in again with the lip liner. It's definitely more lighter. Let's compare it to the NYX one. So yeah, when you compare the two, the NYX one actually looks pinkier. So this is the NYX one in Rosé the Day. This is Rimmel Stay Matte in Mocha. And I think this is why I really like this one, because it's a definitely like a nice warm brown. Is it gonna focus? There we go. That's Mocha. Rose the day. When this one dries matte. It definitely dries matte. Like with this one you can go eat. You can go do whatever and this will not off. So yeah, this is Mocha. Like if I had to do a sw lip swatch video on this lipstick, I would die. Like my lips would die. Right, we're almost there guys. Um, the next one is the Revolution Pro lipstick in Illusion. It's a liquid lipstick. Again, this one is another lipstick that if you like keep this on, like this is not gonna budge, you know? I'm gonna take the suede matte lip pencil. All right, so this is Illusion with the cold brew lip pencil. A lot of my nudes require a lip pencil. I mean, that's just how I am. Um, like the way my lips are, otherwise it's just too light and it washes me out. Um, so yeah, I just always try to have a good brown lip liner and honestly my two favorite, well my, now my three favorites actually are the um, NYX suede matte lip pencil in cold brew, matte cork and the normal NYX lip pencil. Look, I just dropped it again. What is wrong with me? The lip liner in brown, and these three are like my top three. Um, I think LA Girl has a really nice brown one as well. I 
I really do like the Huda Beauty Demi Matte in Shio. This is what this one looks like. Is it Shiro? No, this one's Shio. 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 Oh, I got what they were trying to do with that. Oh my god, this is so velvety soft, like it's just, the formula is so good, but this is Shio, it's so stunning. It's more of like a mauvey pink, mauvey pink nude. Like, nude is so like hard because you can get peachy nudes, you can get brown nudes, you can get mauvey nudes, you can get pinky no nudes, um, but these are just some that I really, really do like. So yeah, this is Shio, Shio. I'm just going to put a little bit of brown lip liner for a mix. One thing I hate is sharpening my lip liners. Like, I can never find a damn sharpener anywhere. Okay, so the next one is the Huda Beauty Liquid Matte. This is my all-time favourite one in Girlfriend. I had to include this one in here. Right, so this is Huda Beauty Girlfriend. I love this one. Like, the smell actually brings memories. I've worn this one so much. Um, and I'm actually quite surprised I still have some left, although I can see, like, gaps in the tube. Okay, I've got one last one that's in my bag, and I have to include that one. All right, so my next one is one that I've used <laughs> quite a bit. This one is the Beauty Pie Lipstick in You Sexy Thing. And honestly, this has been my favorite one. Like, it just makes your lips look so naturally pretty. Like, they're just naturally, like, plush. And I did use this in my Boy Beat video, but it's so nice. It's more on the high-end side, but if you subscribe to their beauty thing, like you can get like a big price drop on this. So I might have to subscribe to them because I've already used so much of this up. I've only got this much left. So yeah, this is You Sexy Thing. I love this one. I saved the best for last. I know it's like a barely bare lipstick, but if you're working, you want a nice natural lip color for days that you just want super quick natural makeup, this is what you need. All right guys, so that's all I have. I hope you enjoyed and found this video helpful. I will link the other videos I have and some other lip colours that I've showed in the past that I also do really like. And yeah, these are ones that I've recently discovered not long ago or a few months ago and they're just so good. The colours are amazing and they work for my complexion. So yeah, if you have any questions, you can ask me in the comments and yeah, I'll see you guys in my next one.